We didn't see a serious accident. I will not use the word fata because fata is when a life is lost. It is serious. Some people have a series of injuries. They derive from the uh, them are general hospital. My investigator is there and for me, I'm also going there to uh, find out the situation. And the information I got was that a car stopped to pay for the thing. And uh, the Tifa truck, whether he faced a break or just a, a careless on his part, ran into the rear portion. And the results we are witnessing now. So, how many people have been affected by this? I was told some people are injured and have been right in the middle of But the normal dead, no. But the uh, normal people have been injured. What can you tell us about the driver of this truck? We cannot conclude that it was a negligence, but if it was a negligence, uh, they are all aware that the toll is uh, here. So as they are approaching, I don't expect a car to speed. Slow the speed before you get to the toll. But if it was a great failure, I cannot uh, say much for now. So for now, what is the police going to do? We are going to conduct our investigation. The person, oh sorry, the person of some has turned the vehicle. This half of the vehicle is totally connected. And then the tow boot is down uh, from this position. So how many people have been injured in this? Uh, uh, actually, currently we have uh, three people at the hospital. There are two people in the vehicle, in the saloon. And then uh, our staff will come who had the two legs. So who was in the boot itself? Or oh, there was nobody in the boot at the time? Uh, fortunately, he's not. He's well, yes. He but he's also no, going to the hospital. He's even in crutches. But he also no, has to go to the hospital. Uh, we don't know unless the doctors come out and say something else. But for now, you can see him in his crutches as usual. There was a motor accident involving a tipper truck and a salon car. Uh, early this morning, uh, some of them have been brought here. We know about seven are here, five males and two females. Uh, out of the seven, two are critically ill. The other five are stable. One of the females is a pregnant woman. She is stable up and about, walking around. However, we are assessing all of them. One of the critical injuries is someone who may lose three limbs. That is two legs and one hand. The surgeons are struggling to save his life at the accident center. So all these people are being assessed. So that is the information I have at the moment. What's the chance? Uh, well, I'll say 50-50. We are doing our best to save the individual. As I said, he may lose three limbs because the lower limbs are more or less crushed, including one upper limb. But our surgeons are all struggling to ensure that we save their lives. Some of them are traumatized, some of them have uh, some abrasions and need minor injuries. Uh, some of them are in shock, one is in sitting in the wheelchair. They are all being assessed now, so that is the information I have at the moment. However, the chances of survival of five is very good.
There is two of them are in critical condition. That is a two-year-old.